Today, hundreds gathered at Memorial Stadium near downtown Terre Haute for the return of an event that helps raise awareness and funds for those with Down syndrome. Garrett Drake joins us now with the details on the 8th annual Buddy Walk. Garrett. Yeah, Will, it was a lot of fun, and it's just amazing to see what events like this can do for the community. The 8th annual Buddy Walk returned to ISU Memorial Stadium to promote acceptance and awareness of people with Down syndrome. The free family event continues to be on the rise. Our very first uh, year, we had um, maybe closer to 500 participants, and then every year we had a little lag with COVID, but the last two years we have had a really great turnout and it grows a little bit more every year and we raise a little bit more awareness in our community every year. There were fun activities prior to the walk itself and the event staff sees the impact the funds from this event have on local families. Seeing this event from start to finish I can see all the work that the community does but also all of the excitement and the way the community comes together for this cause just to raise awareness on Down syndrome but I also see it from the staff level of how these funds and what we are able to do today how it makes a long long lasting impact throughout the Year. Spirits were high and the opening ceremonies included awards for teams that showed the most pride. Organizers like Dixie Russell feel they can leave a lasting message to the community. So my daughter um, is 14 years old and she has Down syndrome and so it's just super important to me to be involved and to bring awareness to our own community. Just promoting acceptance and inclusion for individuals with Down syndrome is just really special and so we just want our community to be uh, more aware and accepting. If you missed the Buddy Walk this year, you can visit dsindiana.org for more information.